Hello everybody, welcome back to another Celeste tutorial. My name is Flash177. Today's episode I'm going to cover the legendary Archie. <laughs> Yeah, Archie is a is a trick you can perform with bubbles, which allows you to do things like this. So, an easy way to get the fast strategy in this room. So, how to perform Archie and what actually Archie is, is the thing I'm going to show you today. Because most people don't know what Archie is, most people think Archie is an extremely hard trick. But to be honest, they both, the, the Archie in this chapter and the Mirror Temple, Make sure to learn these, they are both pretty easy. Even if you're starting out with the game, they are pretty cool. So we are currently in Golden Ridge, um, the chapter we all know and love. This is like still an early part of this chapter. And what you normally do here, if you're new to the game, is probably something like this. And you see how slow that is. And if you're more advanced, you can like jump back and forth. I, I, I will see if I get it. But yeah, do you see? That's like a little hard to get through there. But there's an easy way to do this, and that is called Archie. So what is Archie actually? Archie is a trick when you enter a bubble in a crouch state. And in order to perform entering a bubble in a crouch state in this room, all you need to do is you need to dash downwards like this, or like this, or like this. So any dash input that has a down motion involved like diagonal downwards works and straight downwards works as well and then you need to dash immediately upwards or diagonal upwards like so and with that knowledge you can just do dash down dash up oh, yeah that was too slow dash down dash up and then you get here and you can just uh, hold to the wall a little bit and do the fast cycle pretty easily. Um, yeah, do you see? It, it's not that hard. I can do this like all day long. And that's an easy way to get the fast cycle here. And it's not hard at all. The only thing that's like maybe hard if you're completely new to the game. But it's not really hard is dashing down and dashing up like pretty quickly. So yeah, that's Archie in chapter 4. You can do this out of hyper dashes or ultra dashes as well. You know, walking down here and just do this is not that optimal. So what I recommend to do is when you hyper here, then you probably land somewhere around here and then you do a right down dash like so and then dash into the bubble and you will get the archie too. Like, you see? And now I will show it off the hyper dash. So there we go, that's a good fast way. There you save like a couple of seconds actually compared to what casuals do. And it's really easy, um, learn it. Uh, when you learn Ridge, when you're currently learning strats in Ridge, when you're learning this game, learn Archie it makes this room a ton easier and faster and it's not that hard. And it's like, yeah, it's not, it's not hard. It's actually really easy. Just make sure to dash fast enough because if you see uh, I dash too slow I die you need like you need to do it really fast like so so that's the only bro only tricky thing on this Archie um, so let's move on to the Archie in 5a which is a little bit tricky but can also be useful for newer runners see you over there so here we are back in Mirror Temple. Um, this is the room right after where you go down to the tape for all advanced runners. So that's why it's not available in the 5B route. So this is the room where you have to go with the bubble like so. And you see it, t it takes a lot of time to travel through the room. So one thing that's like really interesting, you can also just do this. And you save like three seconds or what? I, I don't know exactly how much you save. So that's also an Archie. And as you saw, there are two ways to do this um, Archie. Like uh, I mentioned earlier, the Archie in 5 and 4A, you have to dash down and then dash up into the bubble. This Archie, you can also do with a crouch jump into the bubble. 
don't ask me why, but Archie in five in four A. If you do the Archie in 4A with a crouch jump into the bubble, it does not work. It only works on this Archie and don't ask me why. Maybe it has something to do with red and green bubbles. But yeah, on this Archie you can do, use dash down, dash up or a crouch jump. On the other Archie you can only use dash down, dash up. There's not that like much explanation left for me. The only thing you need to do is you need to get, but yeah, you need to get Archie into the bubble like so and right below the um right below the gap you need to dash up and don't hold climb immediately wait a little bit um but this is a really tricky timing to uh, climb up there or to grab the wall on the left or the right uh, i prefer uh, grabbing the wall on the right that's the only tricky thing and when i was learning it i had a little bit of trouble getting it so for newer people it might be quite challenging but I really recommend uh, getting into this if you try to get to sub 40 or something because that is really helpful. It saves a lot of time. It's not too hard. It's like definitely easier than most strats people would learn for sub 40. This is qu quite easy and quite a good time save. I just, I maybe I give a little explanation what I do. So I do crouch, crouch up into the bubble, dash, climb and walk up. That's how I press the button, so... It also works with down dash, da, uh, down dash, dash up. Ah, there I dash too early up. Yeah, you see, I, I got the wall, so I could have gotten up there. Little thing about the crouch dash, uh, crouch jump into the bubble. You just press down and jump into the bubble. After that, you press nothing. You maybe press left. Uh, you maybe press right, not left. Press down, jump, right. Without pressing dash. I think it works also with pressing dash. But there I'm unsure. Yeah, it does. So, that's the Archie in 5A. Pretty easy for me, at least. You see, I can get it quite consistent. Um, It's not too hard. And it saves a good amount of time. So, yeah, learn these two. These are the two Archies that I know, and I think the only Archies that are known yet. Maybe there, there are some in B and C sites or in the Allberry routes. Um, but I don't know about that, I just run any percent. So, yeah, hope you liked the video. Hope I could have, I, I was able to help you, and I hope you will use now Archie, because every Celeste runner should use Archie. Legendary, legendary trick. Um, as I said earlier, please leave a subscribe if you want to learn more about Celeste and speedrunning. I will make more videos about this and see you all on the next video and happy arching.